right right now we're just watching trucks after the store uh, we prepare stuff for the next one uh, me and Abraham getting ready everything here at Kinetti, we uh, try to stay on top of the newest technology with uh, our, you know, our salting and plowing equipment. Uh, this behind me is a, is a is a new salter. We bought a, a couple of those. This we bought a couple of these salters this year. Uh, they actually have onboard computers that will tell us exactly what parking lots the guys were at, how much material they put down, uh, the time of the night or the day that the truck was in the parking lot, just in case there's any. Uh, uh, just slip and fall or something like that, or a customer uh, would like to see the times we're at their site. Uh, these salters are uh, pretty efficient and uh, technologically uh, up to date. So basically, they're more efficient. We're putting down less material and we're getting the same exact uh, uh, performance out of the salt with the melting of the ice. All right, I want to show you a, a new plow that we, uh, a new type of plow we just bought that uh, also is more efficient in uh, the way we snow plow our parking lots. Uh, right behind me is a uh, it's a new machine we just uh, we just started using. We have three of these machines. We brought it to our fleet. It's uh, it's called a bombardier. It's basically it's a, it's a machine you don't really see that much around the states. I actually bought this in Canada. I bought all three of them in Canada, and uh, it's, a, it's a track machine. It's road worthy. Uh, you have to have a registry of a license plate on it and insured. Uh, it'll do up to 30 miles an hour on the road, and we can drive it from site to site on the road as long as it's within. Fair, uh, close distance from each other. That's why we bought three of them so we can spread them out throughout our routes. Uh, basically, the driver sits inside. He could be in a t shirt. There's heat in this thing. And it's mainly just for plowing or clearing sidewalks. Uh, basically, with one of these machines, we can knock a five to seven man sidewalk crew out of the picture. This is our conventional way of clearing sidewalks right now. We have seven in house sidewalk crews. Um, there's actually only six. Quads in here. We got one in the shop we're working on. Uh, we were out last night working in some snow. But basically, this is uh, one of the better ways of clearing sidewalks when you can't get a bombardier on a sidewalk. Uh, you know, you got a guy on a quad on, on an ATV with a plow, they all have plows on them, and then you have uh, the guys behind them touching up with a shovel. We have some snow blowers that we uh, that will run out there and and this is our this is our way we clear sidewalks. We have probably 20 quads total between our uh, some of the contractors and subcontractors that we use out there. So this is the uh, one of the one of the better ways of clearing sidewalks out there. Okay, this is uh, the last thing I'll show you today. Is this uh, they call wide outs? Western puts these out. Basically, it's a it's an eight foot plow. When you're driving down the road, it collapses to eight foot, and then it expands to ten foot. You get an extra foot on each side. And the good thing about this is these are wings right here that actually come in on an angle, not a full scoop. They have D blades for full scoops, but this thing, it definitely uh, it keeps the snow in. And uh, the fact that you can put this on a pickup truck, which usually accommodates an eight foot blade, which is what you're seeing right here. And you can get that pickup truck in a parking lot and, and bring it out to 10 foot. It's, it's pretty big. An extra foot on each side is, is good. And you go down the road at, 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 uh, at eight foot, so that you're not having a, uh, a problem. This is a, a new toy that we got this year for Clown Park. Let's we'll see how it works out. Yeah, we're trying to stay ahead of this storm. We've been out since uh, about 2 in the morning, 1.30, 2 o'clock in the morning. Uh, salting and uh, it's starting to come down pretty good now. We got all our trucks out, all our sidewalk crews out with their ATVs and snow blowers. Um, the loaders and just trying to keep up with this. Got another, I think another five, six hours, and then uh, should be winding down. Good, you know, you can get a, 
it expands from 8 foot to 10 foot. And it's got little uh, hydraulic wings that go in and out. Right now I just have the, the wing on the left side and the straight blade on the right side. Guys are just taking a quick break and topping off the fuel. We'll get back out and keep on plowing. <laughs> 